So I'm Adam Thomas with Nexstar Digital, and we just got done with a lively discussion on fragmentation in the OTT space. And I'm here with... I'm Christy Reap with Falgren Mortine in Columbus. And Claudia Dotslow from Falgren Mortine. So thank you guys for joining. If you were to take one thing, one thing out of the lively discussion that we had, what would that one thing be? I still don't know how many eyeballs it takes. <laughs> Very true. There is not a consensus. No. no. And I think that speaks really specifically to mm -hmm. the challenge with the OTT space. We, I mean, there are just a lot of right. questions that still need to be answered. Right. It felt like almost we, we needed another hour because we were right. still talking ourselves through mm -hmm. how do we solve this fragmentation in the space? And it feels right. like we're making movement towards it, but... At the end of the day, right now, as an agency, how are you solving for that? Um, I think we have to start by really looking at audiences and mm -hmm. looking at how do we connect with that audience versus looking at it from the medium first and thinking about it that way. Um, you know, who we're trying to talk to may drive that decision of where do you start and then what do you fill in around it versus going straight to maybe linear and then adding OTT or mm -hmm. vice versa. I think um, really understanding that audience and your message and what you're trying to accomplish is where you have, you have to focus and start in any, mm -hmm. in any medium, but yeah. particularly here where that fragmentation, there's no solve and there's no solve in the near future. It doesn't seem right. so. Right. <laughs> right. And there's no one solution. I right. don't think, mm -hmm. I think they said, um, you know, the video budget. And I think that's kind of how a lot of us are looking at it and there isn't one solution. Right. Well, what struck me the most, um, coming from you two specifically, is the <laughs> fact that you mentioned that everyone does this. And they so they say they do it. They say they do it, <laughs> right? And so how do you find those that are trusted in the space? That's a challenge. Um, a lot of it comes down to proof of performance, going out on a limb and, and trying a, a program, mm -hmm. um, and then seeing the results through you know proper implementation of tracking and measurement. Um, and then you know, just those relationships that we're able to build with some of those partners too are is a part of that overall conversation. And I think the willingness of some of those partners to work with us mm -hmm. to help figure and solve mm -hmm. things, we all know there's not an answer, a right or wrong answer to any of it yet. Right. Or, or there may never be, but right. how do we work together for the ultimate goal of our brand and our clients that we're working with? And as long as we're on the same team trying to figure it out together, um, I think for us, that's what's really valuable because there is so much opportunity and there's so many directions we can go and there's so many people we can work with who's willing to work with, with us right. instead of just sell to us sometimes is a big yes. part of it. Yes. Transparency, I think, is a key piece of <laughs> yeah. that is who's really being transparent mm -hmm. about what it is they're selling, right? how they're targeting people, and, and all of that. I think that's part of it is, you know, when everybody can sell it, they're not all really versed on what it is they're selling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so confusing out there because mm -hmm. there's so many different ways to target. And we got into that discussion as well. Like, do we target based on content? Do we target based on audience? And right. really, it's both. 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 Right. And so how do you solve for that middle part? And I, I love what you just said, which is that partnership. And how do we come together to say mm -hmm. that? So thank you guys for your time and really appreciate it. And uh, thank you for having us at IAB ALM.